Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. In today's video, I am going to be turning a lot of my godly and legendary pets into shiny pets because I have so many and there's a few right here that I have not aged up just yet, but I do have a lot of them that are maxed out. Um, there are actually a few that I have not gone to yet right here. As you can see, my legendary dragons, or I could say Marshmallow's brother Cheeto, that is what I'm going to be naming him. But anyways, guys, we are in the park right now and let's go ahead and make our way over to the pet shop. Okay, so we are in the pet shop now and I am going to need at least like 13 shiny potions. So let's go ahead and count. So my kitty corns are actually all aged up. So let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So yes, I do need 13 pet potions. I actually have two of them in my inventory right here. One was traded for my friend Florix and the other was gifted to me by my friend Sebi. So thank you guys for those pet potions and helping me save some gems on these pet potions because these pet potions are about $500 each. So that means I'm going to be needing 11 pet potions. Oh my gosh, this is going to cost me some gems right here, but that is totally fine. Um, yeah, so this is how much it's going to be oh my gosh I've been working a lot and grinding so that I can buy that many pet potions for that it looks like I've already spent 5,000 gems in Overlook Bay so I'm getting 500 back so basically I'm getting one pet potion back I guess you can say but anyways guys today is the day that we make a bunch of shiny pets and this day is going to be legendary I'm so excited oh my gosh I've been trying to work on my pet collection so much and I really want to make a bunch of rainbow shinies after this video. I don't know when that's going to be because I have a lot of legendary pets that I still need to work on. Um, we have Jelly right here. Um, he's already a rainbow shiny so I have two more unicorns right here that I think one was gifted to me. And I still have yet to make these um, shinies as well. I might actually end up buying a few more shiny potions because there are some ultra rare pets that I do have that are already maxed. So like my doves and also my monkeys, if I can find them. Oh, right here. Here's my monkeys. Here is my monkeys right here. I can make these a shiny as well. I still have yet to um, age up these other two. So let's go ahead and get started. So what pet should we do first? Let's go ahead and do our kitty corn because it is our most recent sent a uh, godly pet I guess you can say if you guys have not seen the video where I opened a bunch of pet pods and I spun a mystery wheel I ended up getting two kitty corns from that video and oh my gosh look how crazy and kooky that looks oh my gosh its eyeballs are like sticking out yay we got a task done for making a shiny <gasps> look how pretty she is oh my gosh guys we just need two more kitty corns to make a rainbow shiny I am going to be working on making her a rainbow because um as you guys can see she is a rainbow kitty corn okay so moving on to the next pet we have here i think the next pet i have oh okay so it's my alley corns okay so let's go ahead and make a shiny alley corn oh my gosh i actually had two of these in the beginning and i ended up trading one of them away so that only left me with one of them this is actually one of my very first godly pets i've ever gone in overlook bay and I'm actually going to go ahead and name him Blueberry because that was his original name. So this is Blueberry and he is so cute. I'm also going to be working on making him a rainbow shiny as well. 100% positive that he's going to look so cute as a rainbow shiny. Okay, so the next pet that I have here is a giraffe and these were actually gifted to me by fans. I have never Never opened a pet pod with a giraffe before so thank you to all the fans who've given me um, a giraffe for this video so this is what he looks like right here and I think one of the people actually named him spots so I'm gonna go ahead and name him back to spots um, he's so cute oh my gosh I remember seeing a shiny giraffe in my pretending to be poor and overlooked bay video so yes I'm so happy 
happy to finally have a shiny giraffe. This is what he looks like. So beautiful. I can't wait to make him into a rainbow as well. In fact, I think I'm going to try to make all of my legendary and godly pets rainbow. So the next pet we have right here is the strawberry cow. And I actually have five of them because I ended up buying four of them and then someone actually um, gifted one to me. So I have five of them right now, but look at this. Oh my gosh, this is Slushy. That's what I originally named her. Um, let me go ahead and <laughs> rename her. Also guys, if you have name suggestions for my pets, then let me know down below in the comments. I believe I have Rainbow or Shiny Kitty Corn that still needs a name. Um, so the next pet I want to do is uh, my peppermint cow and I actually got these by trading some of my bees. I'm usually never lucky enough to get like any of the wishing well pets besides the starlight dragon. So this is what our peppermint cow looks like. I have no idea if I'm going to be able to make her a rainbow shiny just because these pets are very rare. These came out in the Christmas update of 2020. Okay so the next pet right here we're going to make a shiny is our sweet tooth pet and I actually had four of these like this pet is really cute but for some reason it's not one of my personal favorites so I ended up giving away two of them which I am kind of sad I did because I really wanted to make this pet a rainbow shiny okay so in the future we'll see if we can trade for two more of these so we can make a rainbow shiny but this is just what this one looks like it is so cute it's super bright too like I can barely see the face okay there we go we can kind of see it there okay so the next pet that I'm going to make a rainbow shiny is is my Hollow's Eve Shadow Corns and I absolutely love this pet so much. I actually never bought the Rainbow Rider during Halloween just because, I don't know, I didn't think it was worth it, but now that I think of it, I kind of regret not buying it, and it is probably the rarest pet in the game so far. This is what my Hollow's Eve Shadow Corn looks like. If you have any name suggestions, leave them down below in the comments. Also for my Sweet Tooth, I don't think I've named uh, my Sweet Tooth pet. I will try and see if I can get to more of these hollow eve shadow corns i have no idea if i'm gonna be able to do that um but anyways guys this is what the shiny version looks like with its particles it has like a bunch of stars squares and circle particles as well with the jack-o-lantern faces as you can see oh my gosh i knew this pet was gonna look so good as a shiny because it has that orange color to it already in that orange glow so let's go ahead and make his brother or sister a shiny as well this is the i think this is the dark magic shadow corn yeah this is the dark magic shadow corn that i named spooks i totally forgot what i named i think i ended up naming my hollow's eve one the orange one pumpkin or something i have no idea <laughs> um i really want to use the names that you guys have so this is what the dark magic shadow corn looks like it's not super bright like the hollow's eve one looks like but this is what this one looks like this is a legendary pet moving on to the the next one we have Olaf. Now I am so late to the Frozen game but just a few weeks ago I watched Frozen for the very first time both Frozen 1 and Frozen 2 and I fell in love with the movie. <laughs> I'm so late I know. Okay so for this um, snowman pet I actually have four of them. Oh here we go. Okay so this right here this is the one that we have out but I have two more so I can actually make a rainbow shiny snowman which I'm going to be saving for um, my video video where I make a bunch of rainbow shinies. So look how cute he looks. It is so cute. If you have any name suggestions for my snowman, let me know down below in the comments. Okay, so my next pet is an owl and I only have two of these. You guys actually saw me unbox one of these. I think it was like opening 50 Christmas pet pods. You guys see me unbox um, the, one of these already and I was lucky enough to get another one. I don't know if it was in the same video, but this is what this owl looks like. It is the beautiful snow owl and this pet is legendary so the next pet i have right here is my hex cat and i love my hex cat so much oh oh my gosh look at the guys look at the eyeballs okay that's just not creepy at all 
<laughs> I'm sorry, Hex Cat. So this is what my Hex Cat looks like as a shiny. She is beautiful. I really wish I ended up buying four of these so I can make a rainbow shiny because I think that would look really pretty as well with like the colors that she has going on. So this is what she looks like as a shiny. She is beautiful. If you guys have any other name suggestions, let me know down below in the comments. And the next shiny pet is my bee. So I actually ended up making one of these a shiny anyway. So now I can make a rainbow shiny bee. It's so cute. Okay, so this is my shiny bee right here. It is so cute. Honestly, I I really love the shininess on this because it's yellow and it kind of just matches like the whole um, yellow and black theme. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, so I ended up tweeting a video of my spider dancing to my desktop music. My desktop wallpaper is from Wallpaper Engine and it's like an animated desktop so like particles within my wallpaper move and it plays music. So that is what my spider was dancing to but this is what the shiny spider looks like. I have four spiders so I can make a rainbow shiny later on. As you can see I still have not leveled these ones up. So this is what she looks like and even though I am extremely scared of spiders, guys, fun fact, I am extremely arachnophobic. I do not do well with spiders. If I if I see a spider, if I touch a spider, I'll literally cry. Like I they are my worst fear ever. So to see a spider in the game and say it's cute is honestly saying a lot for me because I just they're my worst fear ever. Okay, so the next pets that you can see right here are actually ultra rares. So let's go ahead and make a shiny dove. I hope I have enough for this. Okay, so I don't think I have enough for this. I think I need three potions. Okay, so let's go ahead and make this dove into a shiny. And I actually can make a rainbow shiny dove because I do have four of them. Oh, it looks so cute. Oh my goodness. If you guys have name suggestions for my dove, let me know down below in the comments too. I know I keep saying that, but oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, so I have a another dove that I want to make a shiny. That means we can make a rainbow shiny later on. Okay, so here is my second dove. And then we have one more pet that we can make a rainbow shiny, which is our monkey. And I have four monkeys, so I can make a rainbow shiny later on. I was really surprised to see that the monkey came back. Like when it was in the game before, I didn't actually buy it. Just because monkeys are probably my least favorite animals. But this one is really cute, so I don't know why I didn't buy it. But I have four now and I hope to make a rainbow shiny monkey as well. Oh my gosh, look how cute his little curly cute tail is and how he runs and stuff. It's so adorable and I love the orange sparkle that we have going on right now. I think my inventory probably got a lot smaller since I done this because I did combine a lot of pets but these are all of my shiny pets right here um if you guys would like to see a pet inventory video then let me know down below I do have a few um rainbow shinies here and there but I hope to make more with my comments and stuff so that's going to be the end of this video I really hope that you guys enjoyed if you have any name suggestions for any of my pets leave them in the comments down below because I really want to name my pets after you guys I think that would be super cool and cute make sure to hit that subscribe button so that you can become part of the donut squad i'd love to have you part of our little family and i will see you guys next time bye